If you want to learn how to lose the weight, if you want to learn how to lose it the right way, then this video is for you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video I have you guys covered, okay? I've lost a lot of weight. I've lost over 40 pounds. A lot of you guys in the comment below have been asking me, please tell us how did you lose the weight? I decided to make a video to show you the correct way, the right way to lose that weight and lose it for good. If that's the kind of thing that you're interested in, make sure you watch this video to the very end because you're definitely, definitely going to learn a lot from it, okay? I'm your coach for today. Take notes, take screenshots, whatever you think you need to do. This video is for anyone that is just starting their weight loss journey, in the middle of their weight loss journey, people that have hit the plateau, that don't know what to do. It's just, it's generally for everybody. Yeah, I'm excited. Are you ready? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't and click like and share this video to anyone you think might also need it. Okay, let's get into the video. Got this pyramid. We are going to walk with this pyramid, okay? we have five things on this pyramid this is the things that we're going to be talking about today so we're going to talk about calorie deficit protein how to track your calories nutrition plan menu and also we're going to talk about how to track your progress okay so in this pyramid i've put consistency outside this pyramid from the left to the right to the bottom without consistency you cannot lose the weight consistency is the key to everything we're going to be talking about Okay, so we're gonna talk about calorie deficit. Calorie deficit is not a diet, okay? It's basically calories in, how much calories you eat, and calories out, how much calories you burn. How many calories you eat is more important than how many calories you burn. If you want to lose weight, you need to take in less energy calories than your body burns. So guys, how many calories do you need to lose the weight? There's many formulas on knowing how many calories to eat. I've done my research and this is the simplest form of knowing how much calories you need to eat to lose weight. So this is how to calculate this. You take your goal body weight in pounds, not kg, and multiply it by 10 or 12. 10 is if you have more body fat to lose and 12 is people with lower body weight that has less fat to lose but guys you would have to pick a reasonable goal body weight okay for example my current body weight is 152 pounds my goal body weight is 132 pounds basically I have 20 pounds to lose so my goal body weight is 132 pounds times 10 which gives us 1320 calories to eat for the day or my goal body weight is 132 pounds times it by 12 which gives us 1584 calories to eat for the day so these are the amount of calories i need to eat to be able to lose body fat now i know how much calories i need to eat for the day now the next thing to do is to give myself a calorie range goal so my calorie range goal could be anywhere between 1500 to 1600 calories for the day so if i try it and i don't lose any weight what I would do is to reduce the amount of calorie intake but nothing less than 1320 calories in a day guys two things I can guarantee that you definitely lose the weight is being on a calorie deficit and your protein I don't care what you do I've put this at the first two as you can see calorie deficit is the first protein is the second of the pyramid list these two are the most important thing. No matter what you do, if you get these two right, you will definitely, definitely lose the weight. They're the most important thing aside for anything that you do. Having more protein in your diet will make you lose weight than fat and carbs. Protein will give you more energy. It will keep you fuller for longer. Examples of protein could be chicken, eggs, lean beef, turkey, prawn, fish, cottage cheese, Greek yogurt, beans, nuts, lentils, quinoa, tofu, chickpeas, you know there's more protein food that you can research on Google. But guys, fats and carbs are not your enemy, trust me, you can still eat them and lose weight. As long as you're in your calorie deficit with the amount of protein you should be eating, then you will definitely lose that body fat. So how much protein should you eat to lose weight? 
I will show you guys how to calculate that as well. With the calorie deficit, you took your goal body weight and multiplied by 10 or 12. No, we're not doing that. We're doing our current body weight in pounds. We're going to multiply by 0.7 to one okay 0 0.7 is for people that have more body fat to lose for example my current body weight is 152 pounds i'm going to multiply that by 0 0.7 which will give us 106 so the 106 is the grams of protein you should take which is 106 grams of protein you should take in a day that's if i multiply by 0 0.7 okay so the next one which is the, what i've been doing lately is to multiply by one Okay, so 152 pound is no brainer, it would give us 152. Okay, so that's 152 grams of protein that I would be taking in a day. So now you guys calculate how much protein you need to take in a day. Very, very simple. The next one of the list is track your calories. Guys, Guys, you need to learn how to track and count your calories accurately. Take about 10 to 15 minutes a day. That's all you need to do this. You need to experience with counting and tracking your calories for at least one month. Start small. Learn how to weigh your food. You need to learn how to track your calories. You need to learn how to write it all down. You need to learn how to read serving sizes and the labels at the back of your food okay you need to learn all those things within that one month okay what you need to do you need to take the first week as trial and error learning how to track your calories but guys don't focus on your calorie goal yet because it's going to overwhelm you and it's going to stress you out and you probably just give up okay so use that first week to track your calories learn just learn how to track your calories basically then the second week continue to track your calories but don't focus on hitting that calorie goal okay give yourself a calorie range like i mentioned earlier then the third week try to hit that calorie goal okay try to hit your calorie goal on the third week by the fourth week you'll be so much so much efficient in counting and tracking your calories the more you count and track the better you know how much calories you're eating okay so after the month for you to see progress guys you need to be consistent you need to be consistent at least 85 percent which is about three weeks of being consistent okay so guys the fourth one on our pyramid is the nutrition plan mini In order to come up with a good nutrition menu to start with, you need to know how to count your calories accurately. And for you to do that, you need to get a full digital scale, any brand, as long as it's digital and it's working, and weigh your food in grams. Oh my God, I cannot stress how much that is so important. People don't actually know this, okay? You need to weigh all your food in grams. Weighing your food in grams will measure the weight of the food instead of a spoon or a cup, which is kind of measuring uh, the volume. So weigh your food in grams if you want to be accurate. So many people are getting this wrong. They say that they're on a calorie deficit, they're not losing the weight, and that is because they're not tracking their calories accurately. So guys, weigh your food in grams. Everything in grams, okay? So next is to start with a simple one ingredient food and to eat similar food every day throughout the week to make it easier what i mean by one ingredient food for example chicken spinach beans with this food you know exactly how many grams they are and what you've put in it compared to a pasta dish for example that's a lot harder to track the calories that's in it best thing to do is to come up with eight to ten foods your go-to meals make a list do a food menu, eat them frequently every week. This will make the whole process a lot easier without thinking about food all the time, meal prepping and tracking. Okay, so it's gonna make everything a lot easier if you do it this way. I have a free weekly blank 
food menu for you to download in the description below so yeah go ahead and download it it's free for you the last on the pyramid is tracking your progress you need to track your progress in different ways okay not just the scale don't hop on the scale and that's the only way to track your progress you need to track your progress different ways because the scale can be quite deceiving okay and that can actually put you off and you give up okay so not just the scale there's different ways to track your progress with the scale you can track your progress monthly go on the scale weigh yourself jot down your starting weight and your weight at the end of the month number two take measurements different parts of your body every two weeks okay not every day not every month every two weeks number three take progress picture monthly take a picture at the start with just your bra top and your pants only take a picture of the front take a picture at the side turn your back and take a picture of your back then take another one at the end of the month the same thing the front side and back and then you compare you will see the difference like i said with the scale the scale might not show any progress but your body will you will see the difference in the month you see the difference that you've lost weight in a month okay so the pictures are quite important and also measurements measurements are also important than the scale all right so again i have a free free body measurement chart in the description below for you to download so go and download it is free write it down all down yeah track your progress so this brings me to the end of this video you guys but what i want to say all this is a process be patient give yourself time and you definitely definitely lose the weight and please 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 stop comparing your progress with other people very 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 important everyone is different okay guys so that's it for me today i hope you've learned something from this video if you have click like and share this video to everyone to your families and friends to help them you know some people need help out there you know to help them reach their goal to help them lose the weight and everything yeah so share with your friends and family thank you again for watching until then i'll see you guys in the next one bye